I'm Tim Morris from Cincinnati State and today I'm going to show you how to do a type certificate data search. First I'm going to go to the FAA website and you can see it knows FAA.gov. I'm going to just go to the main website. In the top right hand corner I have a box and it says FAA for you. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to select mechanics. This will take me to the mechanics page of FAA.gov. I'm looking for type certificate data sheet. If I scroll down over here I've got the type certificate data sheet here. So I'm going to click that and it's going to take me to this. I want to look for the uh, CHAMP 7AC. I happen to know the uh, model number of aircraft I'm looking for today. So I'm putting it in this search box. Now along the side you can see I can if I know the the manufacturer, I can search for it this way. If I know the number of the type certificate data sheet, I can search for it or the type of product. So this left hand column will let me find anything that way. But I like using the search box, which is what I'm going to do. So now I pulled up the type certificate data sheet link for the American Champion Aircraft 7AC. That's who owns the type certificate now. I'm going to click on that link and it opened a box. It opened another box. Uh, the FA has a lot of pages here, but I've got another link up here. You can read this if you want, but I'm just going to show you. I'm going to click this link up here, and that changes this over. And now I have an icon here that is the actual type certificate data sheet. If I click on this, it opens up the type certificate data sheet for the 7AC Champ. Now, what I can do here is I can look through here and I can find what kind of propeller and what type of of engine belongs on this all the different models numbers of this 7AC and here you can see this is the uh, seven, the S7AC the, the original just plain Jane 7AC is here and there's a whole bunch of different models. Here's the model CCM. Okay, so you got the idea. You need to be exact. If you're looking for a model and it's one letter off or one digit off, you got to find the model that exa is exactly your model. Um, the FAA will get you on this if you're taking your test. Let's do one more. I'm going to get rid of this. Let's do one more and let's look for Let's search for a Cirrus SR-22. So I'm going to type in Cirrus here. And here it pulls up. Uh, I want Cirrus Design, which is actually down here. It pulled. There's some other Cirrus companies here. Here's the SR-22 down here. You've got to click on this link. You've got to click on this. And here is my type certificate data sheet for the Cirrus. Important things to know. Uh, here's the SR20. I don't want that. I want the 22. So if I keep going down, here's the SR22 right here. That's the airplane I'm looking for. Okay, the type certificate data sheet, sheet, you can read it. It's got what kind of fuel it runs on, the engine limitations and markings, the type of propeller, that it takes, my different propeller options, and then there's specific things for specific serial numbers in here. So this type certificate data sheet is also going to give you CG, empty, CG information, empty weight, uh, and then you want to look at your control surface movements. So if you're rigging the aircraft, that's in here. Uh, then I go to the notes section and you want to just briefly look through the notes. The FAA will ask you questions that you will have to look into the notes and the notes are found at the end of the type certificate data sheet. So you go through there there's a thing called certification bases that you can find in this type certificate data sheet. Unfortunately these things take a lot of reading and you need to take your time. You may feel rushed but don't get rushed on these things look at the very front, look at the information on the exact model of your aircraft 
the exact propeller of your aircraft, the exact engine of your aircraft that belongs on this aircraft, and then look at the notes at the end, and you'll be fine. I'm Tim Morris with Cincinnati State Community College. Thanks for watching.